Roads to Haleiwa are shut down after a water main break flooded streets and businesses for hours today. Of course, this is a busy time of year for all those shops. Alina Lee spoke with shop owners to see what type of damage they're dealing with. It's even deeper back here. Streets and businesses in Haleiwa were flooded after a water main break near Kamehameha Highway and Lokoea Place. I have at least a, probably a foot of water inside the store. We're going to be out of business for who knows. Things that are lost that we'll never be able to save. Uh, paperwork. Oh, God. It goes on and on. According to some stores, it took hours for the water to be turned off as they tried salvaging as much as they could. It's been three hours, a little more than three hours. They still haven't been able to shut their water off. Until we get the water stopped, there's nothing we, we can really do. I mean, we blocked it off as much as we can with sandbags, but the water's coming out right around the backside. And we're just trying to mitigate any uh, water buildup, let it free flow into the actual river. Shop owners say this water main break is the worst they've ever experienced. Never had this much water damage. It makes me sick to walk in there and, and look at it again. I'm just trying to kind of keep myself together here and figure out where to go. When we first came here about 2021, we saw a water main break, and that one wasn't as bad as this one. It even looks like the bus stop next to Rip Curl has gone into what a sinkhole. We will probably be open tomorrow, but depending on how much, the, how bad the damage is. Others don't know how long it'll take to recover. We're pretty persistent about keeping the doors open. Alina Lee, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.